Hey guys, so today we're going to be going through and swatching a new line from Essence. These are the Color Boost Matte, Mad About Matte Liquid Lipsticks. They look like this. So if you guys are curious to see the colors and the swatches on my skin tone, then just keep watching. Alright, so I have a whole assortment of shades in front of me, so we are going to get to swatching and trying these on. now. The claims on this would be highly pigmented liquid lipstick with a dusty matte finish that dries to stay, second skin feel, and date proof. I might try kissing one of my kiddos and see if it truly is kiss proof, so let's check it out. First color looks like this. This one is number two, I love you, me neither. Okay. Let's see, is it a squeezy tube or a wand? It is like an hourglass shaped doe foot wand. So let's start off with swatches here. That's a pretty like peachy neutral shade. These have more of like a sheer type of finish to them. They're not fully opa opaque, so if you're looking for something that's like a hybrid between like a lip tint and a liquid lipstick, this might be up your alley. But here's number two. Next up we have number three, Wanna Play. That's more like a dusty rose. Here's number three. I would say this one's more of like a Your Lips But Better shade for me, for my skin tone. Better. Next up we have number four, Mad Matters. That one's a deeper rose shade. This is the first one that's actually looking opaque. So here is number four. Next we have number six. This one is Funk You. It's like a bright fuchsia pink. Here's number six. It's very bold. Next up we have number seven, Seeing Red. Do you see what I mean about saying it looks like a stain? It's not like a liquid lipstick. These actually remind me a lot of the formula of the Sephora Popsicle lip stains. The formula reminds me a lot of those. Here's number seven, Seeing Red. This one's like a strawberry red. So not blue tone and not orange tone, it's just strawberry color. Best way I can describe it. Two more left. Next up we have number nine, Magnetic Gloom. Magnetic Gloom, yeah. It's like a deep wine Merlot shade. I don't drink, but that's what I think deep red wine looks like. Here is number nine. Last one in the collection that I have is number 10, Pride and Prejudice, which looks like it's gonna be like a blackened plum purple shade. Yes, very, very dark purple.
And here is number 10, not my cup of tea. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing these swatch. Let me show you how they dry down on the hand. Obviously the first few that I've done are completely dry and they're not going anywhere. There's nothing transferring to my fingers. Obviously the ones that I just did would. But the first few that I applied are not moving anywhere. They are dry, they are matte. So I mean you can kind of get a feel for the colors based on the swatches on my skin tone and you can kind of see what the colors look like right here. They're pretty much spot on. What you see in the tube is what you're going to get on the lips. So I hope you guys enjoyed this swatch video. I hope you found it helpful. If you did enjoy this video, please remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.